greenhouse. You can see where the freeze got these ones. So I've been receding. Then I thought, oh, I better film this. These are doing good. These, okay, these ones right here are broccoli. I got my little tags. I remember what's what. This is kale. And in here I have um, Tom and Thumb tomatoes, it says. No, lettuce. There's lettuce in there. I don't know where the heck I got tomatoes from. Okay, there's lettuce in that one. This one's kale, so there's two different kinds of kale growing. And then, that's an iceberg lettuce in this one. So, two different kinds of lettuce, two different kinds of kale. And then, uh, what did you say that was? Broccoli. Okay, but I gotta redo these two melons got killed. And then I have my seeds I did myself. And my boot, and I just put some from my stuff last year, my own seeds, which they worked, but they got killed. So the ones that it worked, so I know they worked. I mean, drying them out and stuff. So these are my seeds I have to redo. So I'm gonna do that right now. <coughs> Brenda from Maine, Manic Grandma, how you say it, told me to cut off the seed pods. I cut them off and stuck them in here to dry them out off of both of these. That's a lot of right there. Yeah, see, so that's what they look like. Seed pods, so they're off. I didn't realize. Okay. They're over here digging. This is where I'm going to plant flowers for my I mean, in memory of my mom too. Right here is the seed. All the seeds. So I'm going to put them in this empty container that I cleaned up from having a roasted chicken in the store. And I'm going to use them to dry up the seeds in the greenhouse. And the boys are doing all that. I already planted the lily my husband got me for Mother's Day. And then, uh, even though we have no kids together, we do have two dogs. And, um, he just does it, and I do it for him too. And then he's clearing out all the grass, and we're planting it. Okay. There they are. I'm to play with them, guys, but them guys are busy. Okay, these are what I had to reseed. I had to reseed in my greenhouse because they froze. That's kind of messy, but I know what it says. So I had to replant, reseed my things in there because that freeze. Yeah, I did plant some of these for a different it. brand. These are from Vic um, Victoria like Seeds. That. So these are ones that I'm going to use if I have to redo. Like when I start planting in the ground, I'll do some, good, some eggplants. I'm going to do some of these tomatoes in the bathroom and some of it didn't come up. I might try some spinach in the bathroom because it didn't come up in the greenhouse yet. And then these peas, I'm not sure if they came up. Oh, the peas came up over there. They're doing really good. Right there. I can see them. No peas. Okay. There's a kitty update. Can you see him? She's got her babies. I don't want to really open the door. Maybe I can because she's laying that way. Let's see. Hey there. She's a good mom. They're all okay. She's just laying with them. Looks like they're napping. No, no, like none of them are eating. Cool. Boys are working. You can't judge somebody because of their dad. Dogs are laying. I wonder what I'm doing. Sitting in this area today. Watching the wind, so don't pick up my umbrella. That's a neighbor's brush. Here's a greenhouse from the outside where we did some seeds. We're going to start leveling those out more because I'm going to start doing ones I can do outside pretty soon. Um, it's supposed to start warming up starting Friday. I think tonight's the last cold night is what they're saying until the end of the month. Looks like all clear days, so we'll see. Okay, do that. Got a few planted. We'll finish when the boys get their sides done. Man, you're tired. That's how far we are on that. And now they're leveling on all the dirt so I can plant. 
They got all the grass and stuff out, and then I planted all the flowers, daylilies and stuff from out of my garden because I have them everywhere. I'm making it here too. Why isn't that stopping? Okay, I went in and made them pizza. They came in and got their snacks, went over back, came out. And guess what? I caught them working. What the heck? Good guys. Just working. The guys are working to follow me. Okay. Some off flowers coming through. The green of them. But now you see all flowers. They'll be blooming not until July, August. This side does get some grass, but not enough to worry about. So I don't mulch anymore. Used to. Ponds are nice and dirty. Got all the beds looking good. Look good. We made sure that the ones that were not mixed were mixed. Good. We realized we missed these, but we did not mix the ones that were already mixed. Good so job, good job. Already did. I don't remember doing this. This is the section we're putting a. I set it around the way I wanted. The boys are going to push it back down. We're doing this in memory of my mom. These flowers look really good next year. Over there is where I have my dog, Reva, buried years ago. So this is turning out really good, and they went through and leveled everything out so I can plant. A little bit of weeds in the corner of that one, I'll get it. That's all mint. And here, I'm hoping the herbs will come up. Over there, we're going to see that one over there for mulch. That right there is just weeds right now. There's my mess. Sun's are shining. So I got the fan going in there, keep the heat blowing. Replanted all these. Not cleaning off these yet. Not gonna do the tomatoes until later. Can't get them out. He's spray painting that table. I do a lot of spray painting too, but he likes it, so I'm letting him. Here's a sign I redone. It was just like all faded. So I kind of darkened it in. All my kids' names on the back. Got Crystal, Angel, Roger, Anthony, Cody, Desi, Jordan. Them are all seven of my kids. Got all these to decorate the yard with first. They're just sitting up here for right now. So we get this all straightened out. Got these paint those statues. Got stuff over here to paint. Get everything organized. Probably next time. I only have them work for like three hours every time they come over. I don't want to overdo it. We have plenty of time to get it done. That's our all, all going to be tomato plants. we got to clean them all up and redo them. There's the painter. So we got three yellow chairs over there and another one's probably over there. There's four all together and then this red table. We're going to go right here. And right there's the umbrella. It's going to be in the middle right here. Really heavy duty chairs, they look little, but I can sit on them. That means almost anybody can sit on them. There's the garden. He's over there still working. He put his stuff away, they're cleaning up. I'm gonna probably call it a day until Friday because we're gonna have rain tomorrow and Thursday. Today is Tuesday. They get a break. I don't know if I'm able to get these together, but he got it. He painted the chairs. I finished. Well, I started the table. He finished. So we painted them red. They're really old and yellow. And got a lot done today. So we're going to fill these next time. Get them ready for that's for the dirt. Get them ready for tomato plants. That's peat moss. We're going to add some of that to each of them to make sure there's enough. And then we're going to dump. All these buckets that have stuff in them, so we can redo all those. These um, these ones like that. So I'm hoping I can get these two together because my phone shut off. It sits in the sun too long. It's hot. We're gonna paint those sometime. 
Now we'll set tomato plants and stuff here. We'll get all this weed whacked out. We're up there, he's trying to project with spray paint and water. He's trying to do a camel thing. I don't know what he's doing. I told him the water's probably too cold and it's not warm enough. It's got to be at least 50 degrees. And I think my phone is up in personal close right now. There's the dog. Yeah, it is. So, God bless everybody, and I'll try to put these two together. See you tomorrow.